Hi my friends, welcome again to your channel Let's Break. In this video's tutorial, we will discover Conic Projection, Lambert, Olbers and Polyconic. Conic Projection Examples When you place a cone on the earth and unwrap it, this results in a conic projection. Some of the popular conic projections are Olbers equal area conic and the Lambert conformal conic projections. Both of these types of map projections are well suited for mapping long east-west regions because distortion is constant along common parallels, but they aren't terribly good at projecting the whole planet. Here are some details on conic projections and how maps use them today. Olbers equal area conic projection The Olbers equal area conic projection is commonly used for displaying large countries that require equal area representation. For example, the USGS uses this conic projection for map showing the continent as United States 48 states. H. C. Albers introduced this map projection in 185 with the standard parallel C. And, as the name states, the purpose was to project all areas on the map proportionally to all areas on Earth. Albers equal area conic projection distortion. I call projections. The Olbers equal area conic projection has map distortion. Distances and scale are true only on both sandwood parallels with directions being reasonably accurate. Areas are equal to say areas on Earth. Those not conformal, perspective, or equivalent. Lambert conformal conic projection. The Lambert conformal conic is one of the many creations by Lambert in 1770 to still widely used in the United States today. It looks like the Olbers equal area conic, but graticular spacings differ so that it's conformal rather than equal area. It uses a conic developable surface second at the standard parallels, usually a 33 deg and 45 deg to minimize distortion. However, Standard parallels vary depending on location. For example, Canada's standard parallels are usually 49 and 77. Furthermore, the SAIC plane coordinate system SPCS uses LCC when zones have an east west orientation. Lambert conformal conic projection map properties. The major advantage of a Lambert conformal conic map projection is how it retains conformality. This bicarystances are reasonably accurate and retained along sanded parallels. It isn't equal area as distortion increases away from sanded parallels. Polygonic projection. This now obsolete map projection uses an infinite number of cones tangent to an infinite number of parallels. This type of protection is generally used for countries that span along a longitudinal extent. Air polygonic projection. All meridians except the central one of curved lines. Only along the central meridian, distances, direction, shape, and A is true. However, distortion grists away from its central meridian. Oikai projection distortion. Overall, this app projection compromises nephropolis. It's neither from formal, spec, or equal area. Conic projection advantages and disadvantages. Unlike cylindrical maps, conic map projections are generally not well suited for mapping very large areas. They are more suitable for mapping continental and regional areas. For example, Olbers equal area conic and LCC are common for mapping the United States. Polar orientation conic projections have their cone center point directly above the pole. Meridians are straight converging at the pole. Parallels are arc circling the pole. Parallels cross meridians at right angles. Tangent cones result in one sand line where the scale on that line has no distortion. Second cones cut distortion down with the standard lines. These standard lines have no distortion, but it increases away from these lines.